Hey, this is Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. I got asked this question. How can I get access to more than one Gmail or Google Workspace account at the same time? I thought this would be a great use of a video, but before I show it to you, hit that subscribe button because I got a lot more videos coming out on how to use Google Workspace or Gmail as business tools. So you can see I'm logged into my business uh, company page here. I'm on my social tab so you can't read all my private confidential business email and I'm being a little satirical. But I'm going to show you how I can open another email account while I'm looking at this one right here. By the way, if you notice right up here, see right here it says Gmail, excuse me, Google.com slash mail slash UO. It means user zero, which is in fact the first user in this web browser, the first account opening up mail. But watch this, see my logo right here? Click on that. So I can go down here and open another account. I've already added three accounts. Here's my wife's, her, my business partner, and here's the testing one. Watch when I click on that. So it comes up, and again, I'm in the social tab so you can't read our business email. Notice this is user two. I don't know why user zero and then user two, but watch this, I can open up yet another one. And here, I mean, if you hover over the picture, you can see I'm in Teddy Burris at gmail.com. That shows up as user four. Uh, I'm not sure why the difference is. Uh, but anyway, this account right here is user zero. It's my business account. I can do everything I want to do in here like normal. And over here on user two is Burris Consulting at Gmail. And the last one of the, th of the three I've opened if I hover over that, it's Teddy Burris at gmail.com. Now, something to be aware of, if I, anything I do over here, if I open anything else up, like if I go open up slides, it's going to open up as U0 before it gets to here. And anything I open here, if I click on that and I open up, you know, let's say um, Drive, it's going to open up right beside it before this one. And then when I open this one up, you'll see if I go over here, and I open, let's go open contacts. It's gonna open contacts as U4. So everything between here and this first one is U0 Google. Everything between here and this one is U2 Google. And everything from here over would be U4 Google. So Google's, and, and this is all in Google Chrome. Google Chrome keeps them all together so that it knows which one of these other Google apps are associated with this Google account that's looking at this Gmail. Pretty easy to do. Just be careful you don't want to be moving these around because if you move these tabs around, it's going to get the system confused and it'll start making dumb mistakes. Google Workspace and Gmail. You can have multiple accounts open in one browser it's a very effective way of using multiple accounts if you have to. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. And I hope these ideas are helpful for you.